nine months in space, what does it do to you? We're seeing it in real time with NASA astronauts Suni Williams and Butch Wilmore currently on their extended mission. First, bone loss. They, like all long-duration astronauts, face significant bone density reduction. You can lose up to 1-2% to of bone mineral density. That's like aging decades in a year. Imagine what Suni and Butch are experiencing. Vision changes. Space can flatten your eyeballs, affecting your sight. It's called space flight associated neuroocular syndrome. How are Suni and Butch's eyes adapting to this prolonged microgravity? Their blood? It redistributes. They lose red blood cells, leading to space anemia. And their immune systems? Weakened. More susceptible to infections. These are the physical challenges Suni and Butch are navigating. Balance? Forget about it. Their vestibular systems are being tested daily. Returning to Earth? Relearning to walk will be a real challenge for Suni and Butch. But. Astronauts fight back with intense exercise, specialized diets, and constant monitoring. Suni and Butch are doing just that, but the effects are still profound. Nine months in space, it's a brutal but fascinating challenge for the human body. And Suni Williams and Butch Wilmore's mission provides vital data for future long-duration space travel.